guys, Gia's here, and I'm back with something new, something different, something I've never reviewed, something like this before. Okay, let's get on with it. I have one of many of the new LEGO Ninjago Prime Empire Season 12 sets. Now, this is weird because we've only just got the trailer for Prime Empire, and here I am with one of the sets. It's weird, I had to pick it up. This has been in my drawer for so long, as well as one other set, which will be next week's review. Stay tuned for that. But this is a 4 plus set. This is Cole's Speeder Car. This is set number 71706. This is so weird. The box is pretty damaged because I got this from Argos. But it just says here, learn to build. It comes with Cole and it comes with this dude, which is... A very interesting looking fellow and it doesn't actually show what uh, their names are so I'm gonna have to do some research let's open this of course we have two main bags we've got that little piece and then we have the instructions so without further ado let us get everything here built up let's go Now, I want to look at this bad guy first because I have his name in my head. It's just the fact that it's really weird. So this is Halsner. Halsner, Halsner. Thank you, thank, thank you, Jeanette. But um, we've just done some research, and this is so weird. This is a seriously weird minifigure. I mean, like the head for some reason reminds me of like Master Splinter from Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. No, he reminds me of um, Lord Garmadon from season two. Oh my. Right. <laughs> he's fighting the overlord. Oh. That's what it reminds me of. Special guest appearance from Jeanette, ladies and gentlemen. Hey. <laughs> but yeah, he has this really weird blade and I really like it. It's literally a games console with just this transparent blade just coming out of it. I love it. That is just amazing. Actually, that's a controller, not a console. Controller, console. <clears throat> I don't know! <laughs> he has some really weird printing, like targets all over his chest and his legs. He's got this little piece here that is just so weird. It looks like a, an 8-bit version of a piece of cheese for some reason. That's so weird. His visor doesn't move, it's literally just molded to his head. I love that. That is amazing. Let's put him back on his little surfboard. And then we have Digicole, 
as they have called it on the internet. With this new Prime Empire wave, this looks amazing. I'm kind of excited. This is great. I love the blade. I don't know what they're going to call it. It looks really cool. I love just the mixture of the white and the transparent uh, neon green. It's kind of like what they did for Nauticon's blade from season 6, but just switched up. Now, he is so weird. He's got like these blue targets all over him. It's so weird. Everyone kind of looks the same in their uniforms. Nothing's really different about them except from the logo on their masks and maybe the belt. He has this weird face. What is up with this? It might be like a disguise or something. But then he has like his normal Lego movie face on the back, of course. But that is so weird. It's definitely something new, which I was asking for. Well, I love that. All right. So we first move on to this guy's. I'm not even going to try and pronounce his name again. Um, he has this hoverboard, which is like, it's literally a surfboard, but with two one by 2 plates at the bottom, so then it can glide. And the feature is also with this car that he holds this chain like he's been like he's just attached the chain to the to the speeder car he's kind of like following after it that is really cool so as you can see just by me doing this it, it completely rolls perfectly this is brilliant now like I said at the beginning of the video on the box it does say this is a 4 plus set which means that uh, kids from the ages of 4 plus can build this so anything in the set is printed, nothing is stickers. So this part at the front, which looks amazing by the way, this is all printed. I love that. That is really cool detail and I love it. It's just got Cole's logo on it. It's got a little um, ninja right here, the number four for some reason, which I assume is like for the age four plus thing. Ninjago, ninja, that's great. So of course Cole's colour scheme is black with hints of silver and orange. I love it. This is great. It's just so unique for something that is just new. It's great. Of course I'm going to put his blade right there. Now one more thing I wanted to show before I left was the instructions which I rarely ever show. <laughs> So on this side you can see all of the new Prime Empire Lego sets, of course we've got Cole's one down here, we've got, um, looks like a J-plane and a Lloyd bike, there's this buggy thing that looks weird, a blue Techno Dragon by the looks of things, um, a Fire Mech, nothing new there, the Gamer Market which Jeanette and I really want to get because it comes with the figures that we want, and um, then there's this, a giant technical fortress. It looks so weird, but there are also the gamer pod sets, the avatar pods. There are three of them. There's Lloyd, there's Jay, there's Kai. I have Kai with me currently that I'm going to review next week. And then on this side, we have this really cool artwork, and I love this. I think you can see in the bottom there, is that the pink ninja? Yes. Um... <laughs> Hey, so Zane does make an appearance in this because a thing that I pointed out to Jeanette is that Zane as a minifigure does not appear in any of these sets except for the gamer market in his pink ninja outfit, which has been a first for Lego to make. And let's be um let's be honest, he yeah. totally rocks that suit. <laughs> yes he does. Yes he does. So Jeanette and I will definitely be getting the gamer market to review on both of our channels. For Jeanette's channel, I will leave it in the description below so you can go check her out. She does book reviews, she does Lego reviews like I do. She's a bit more verbal. <laughs> I'm a bit more lewd and crude. Lewd, crude, and sensibly rude. So if you're not a child, do not go there. <laughs> Anyways, I really hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to ring the bell so you can be notified when another video like this comes out. And next week, I will have the Kai Avatar pod on this table, ready to review and speed build. So I shall see you guys next week. Bye!